Hey guys, what's going on? Sam right here from Hilliard's Rim Lines. We're doing another tire topic today. So today's topic is going to be the worst tire and tread pattern ever, ever made. <clears throat> I repeat, the worst tire and tread pattern ever made. So right off the bat here, we got a set of 225, 45, 17. These are Continental Conti Pro Contact. All right, so I repeat, Continental Conti Pro Contact. Now, why am I picking this tire? Because this tire, actually this tire is made in Germany, so you would think that would be good quality because it's a European tire. But right off the bat, this tire was very big a few years back. It came stock on a lot of vehicles, OEM, a lot of Nissans, a lot of BMWs, I'm trying to think Volkswagens. Everybody had this tire on their vehicle brand new. So right off the bat, let's get down to the negative points. Right here, look at this. We have uneven wear right here on the inner side of the shoulder here, completely smooth and rounded. Okay, this is where the tread pattern should have been. It should have came all the way up here, but now we have uneven wear. Another negative factor is that we have, if you can see closely, we'll try to zoom in as best we can, is that we have weather cracking going on in between all of these tires, okay? And this tread pattern is not that aggressive. Brand new, it didn't have much tread on it. This is about 50% worn. There's the wear bars right there, as you can see. Uh, overall, the tire tread is smooth, no uneven wear on top here, but uneven wear on the sides. Weather cracking in between. The tread pattern is very basic. There's no sipes for water. You can count these as them if that's what Continental wants to tell you. And these tires, believe it or not, are very expensive to buy them brand new. They're not the cheapest tire on the market. So that's one example why we're doing this tire review is to let you know that, you know, this is one of the worst tires ever made. I have replaced so many of these tires. They came stock from the factory brand new. But the problem was that when by the time they get worn, they only got about 30 to 40,000 kilometers on them brand new. And I would come here, I'd rip them off, and I'd replace them with either a Bridgestone uh, Terranza or I would replace them with, you know, something else. So now this tire is no longer being made, it's being phased out. So that's why I'm currently doing the review on this to let you know this is the worst tire ever made. Right off the bat, that worn shoulders, this should never have happened. I know you could say the customer's alignment or it could have been the customer's, you know, negligence, but this is something that you have to keep in mind on this tread pattern. So thanks for watching, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Amar. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter at Hilliard Dreamlands or my personal account. Thanks for watching.